Welcome back to Wearing the Heart is Tiffany. On today's channel, we are talking about all the things I brought back from Ghana. I got clothes and shoes and bags and earrings. We just got so much stuff. So normally I'll bring this stuff back to wear, which some of them I did. Um, but also I brought things back to sale because people are like, oh my God, I love your fan. I love this. I love that. So some of these items are available on Amazon or you can buy them directly through me. But let me know, what do you get when you travel? Do you get refrigerator magnets, mugs? Um, is it just a photo? Like, tell me what do you bring back? And the other question is, do you bring back stuff for other people? All right, let's get straight into this video. Come on. Hey, this is our pants outfit and it is from Ghana. As you can see, it's a little wide leg, which I kind of like. Um, it fits well right here. You just zip it up and actually there, yeah, you zip it up right here and there's a button. So this could be a crop top if you like to expose your stomach. I expose just a little bit or you can pull it down this way and you can go as further down as you want on the sleeves right here. They're quarter length sleeves and you can do off the shoulder. And then this is just the way the back look. Yeah, I don't have a butt, but I feel like I have just a tiny bit of a butt in this outfit. So what do you guys think? It is perfect for the springtime. I love it and it is so cute. Tell me what you think. And this material is blue, brown, and white. Then I paired it with some white brown sandals. You can pair it with any color you want, but this is definitely one of my faves. <laughs> Our next outfit is a short outfit. As you can see, I have my hands in my pockets because we have pockets. Anybody know about outfits? You love pockets and they're actually pretty deep, y'all. I'm going this way. Um, anyway, it's you can go up to your knees right here. There's room in here and this is another zip up and button. Um, and as you can see, the pattern matches the top or the top matches the bottom. This is a very thinly sleeve. So as you can see, you will wear like a half bra with this one. And it also zips up in the back right here. Super, super cute. You can wear. You get out of the way. Our next one is this is a versatile dress that I bought in the market. And in the market, it was already pre made. So, as you can see, it is a supposed to be one size fit all. Um, and we have pockets. Y'all know, as women, we love pockets. Put our keys and put our phones in there. So, this is like a, this right here. You probably could wear like a different type of bra to kind of hold it up a little bit. But the back is the fun part. So, you can actually change the back. You see, this is this type of design. But the strings are super, super long. I can't take them off right now, but they literally go down to, you can tie them as many ways as you can. So this is that versatile dress that you can probably put about two or three different ways. And it's such a fun dress. What do you guys think? I love it. Last but not least, we have our swimsuit edition. Um, so this right here is like a kind of a crimp style right here. And then this kind of opens up and this one actually has like a double strap that you can use. And so the back is a halter top. So you just tie it back here. You guys can see that right there. And then this right here is actually a like little two piece. So here's a skirt. It's super sweet. Like I would wear the skirt y'all by itself um, if it didn't have this little split right here. But underneath it also has this right. Yes, I have my underwear with it but this is what it looks like underneath so it's another crimp style right here um and yeah so you actually got a three-piece swimsuit i have got other swimsuits made from her so tell me what do you guys think about this and pair it with some cute little shoes and you're ready for the beach go Turn, 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 turn,
All right, y'all, let's get into these fans. This is what the fans look like, y'all. They are huge. And when I tell you, this ain't your regular church fan. This is the fan that's gonna really get you some wind going. So these are awesome. I love these fans. And I love it because they usually come in different designs and they are photos. So they don't have to stay. They stay like this. They go straight into your purse. They have a little uh, a thing where you can close it. And these are super awesome. Um, I'm gonna just show you a couple patterns that we have. This is another pattern. Um, I love these. Um, here is another pattern. And I, they're just so colorful. Like you can pair it or match it with any outfit because it got so many colors in it. So yeah, check out the Ghana fans. These are definitely on Amazon and they're selling out really good. So make sure you get one. Y'all, let's get into these earrings. Okay, so these are definitely some of my favorite right here. Uh, this is the design on the front with the cowrie shell. So this is how they look if I were to put them on. Let's see if we can get them on, y'all. So we can see what they look like. So this is what they look like up close. They're super beautiful. I love these earrings. Um, Another one we have is this one. It's a print of Africa on here. Um, I really, really like these as well. Yeah, I like all of them. I say that every time. <laughs> um, so if you're wearing black, these are perfect. Um, these are actually, they sell them there, but they say these are from Kenya. I love, love, love these. Um, if you like me, you like a little, not, these aren't blings, but I just love colors. And so that's how they look over here. I'm gonna put both of them on because, so you can see the effect of them. So these are very, very pretty. They almost remind me of South Africa though, but they say they're from Kenya. Um, we also have these, they're also very similar, but these are in yellow, so. Just put them on so you can see them. There you go. And we have one more pair that I'm gonna show you. And these are these. So if you like colors and just different designs, like I think you would like these. Let me know which one's your favorite. Fashion earrings are an accessory for me. If I don't have on a necklace, I'll for sure have some earrings on. Okay, y'all, these, I love these. I have been getting these from Ghana for forever, ever since I started going. Um, I am a very feminine woman, but I hate purses. Um, so this is more so what I carry. Um, here's the strap right here. And when I tell y'all, it fits so much. You just open it up right here. There is a zipper right here that is very very deep um so you could put like your smaller items in this part right here and then you have all of this room right here you can put so much stuff in here so I'm usually carrying around a lot of stuff in this one. So this is an example of this one. So these are the same. They just come with the different patterns and stuff like that. It looks very stiff, y'all. But once you get to wear it, it's going to loosen up and you put a lot of stuff in the air. Um, this is another design that I wanted to show you all. Um, so this is a different type of bag. I normally don't get these type of bags, but I actually really like that. You can put it on like a backpack. There is... A, a zipper right here where look at my hand can fit all the way down into here um, and then they also have a zipper right here in the front so get another thing right there um, they got some crisscross action going on here and then there's another small zipper right there um, so I thought this was cute it's almost like vintage but with a bunch of colors so tell me how I wish I think about this one I like these bags and backpacks. This right here is, I love these. It just looks like this, but these go over 
your clothes and you just tie them this way. Let's see if I can go back a little bit. I love these. Put on a black dress, it adds so much flavor and pizzazz to your dress. Um, and then you just tie them. So I guess I could tie it this way as well, if I like. I could do it this way where the tie is in the front. So it's really up to you of how you wanna put um, these on. And I bought several of these as well. Mom, look at it. <laughs> so yeah, I actually forgot that I have waist beads. I forgot all about these. These are the different kinds that you have. These are the ones that you just tie um, around. And depending on your waist, you can cut these and kind of retie them at the end. But I just got a couple different um, beaded size. Some of them are a little bit bigger. Um, I know people are into waist beads. I actually have never worn waist beads before, um, but I know that people love them. Like this one is a, a cool one. Um, so you literally just tie these around your waist. There are different meanings to these waist beads. Some people do it as like spiritual thing. People do it as weight loss thing. Um, when we were in Ghana, I saw a little baby with these on and they put these on the baby to almost like measure like how big they're getting. So I thought that was cool as well. So if you use waist beads, tell me how you tie them around. Some people say you're not supposed to show them. Some people say you're supposed to show them. I heard women say they make them feel sexy. Like I'm not really sure. Um, again, maybe I should try them y'all. Should I give them a try? Um, basically wear my own product, I guess. <laughs> so let me know what do you guys feel about waist beads and they will fit they fit these fit my stomach so i know they can fit yours as well because i'm plus size woman so yeah there you go let's show you some sandals so i got these pair right here these are kind of like beaded in the african colors i will say that you definitely have to wear them because like this part is like very stiff um, so I would not say these are the most comfortable shoes, but I feel like if you break them in, they should be fine. Um, I really like these ones because they are beaded. Can you see the detail in those? We'll put it this way. I love those colors in there. Um, I actually forgot I had these. I have not worn these yet, y'all. This is cost shopping too much when you don't even wear the stuff that you buy. Um, and then this is our third shoe. I like this beaded and you have the tie in the back. Again, these things have to be worn in because these things are very hard. And if you can see the shoe, I guess it's a little bit bendable, but yeah, I feel like they're, break them in for sure. Wear them around the house before you wear them outside, but they are definitely cute. Um, so check out the sandals and these are usually, um, made by someone. Um, and they, sometimes they can make them like right in front of you, but these were already made. So check out the sandals.